Greetings and salutations, Earthlings. My name's David Rodwin, and this is some epic bullshit. Today I'd like to talk about the Muppets, and about Occupy Wall Street. The Muppets teach kids about things like greed. Now Fox News interpreted that as teaching kids anti-corporate values in a form of class warfare. Now here's how I see it. The very first Muppet movie in 1979 and the very newest Muppet movie that came out just this year have a lot of things in common. One, they've got a bad guy. Now here's the thing about bad guys. The bad guys in the Muppet movies aren't rapists and murderers. The bad guys in Muppet movies have one thing in common. They're greedy. That's it. They're just greedy. Now, Fox News had a big problem because the Muppet movies named their character who was greedy Tex Richmond. And worse, he's an oil guy. Why are the liberals and Muppets always ganging up on the poor little oil guys? It's just not fair. But here's what the Muppets are actually teaching. It's not that it's bad to be rich, it's bad to be greedy. And to pepper spray your friends. And here's the more important thing. The way you win is not by defeating the greedy guy directly. Instead, what you do is you show incredible integrity. You fight with all you have and try your hardest. You rely on your friends and you remain good and true to your cause. And you lose. But here's the interesting part. This is how you win even by losing. Because you set such an extraordinary example, the really greedy dude's henchman has a change of heart. You transform him internally by setting an external example to the entire world. And in both the first Muppet movie and the last Muppet movie, the greedy dude's henchman turns on him because he finally sees he can't live anymore with the terrible things he's doing. Like pepper spraying Elmo. And maybe that's the way Occupy Wall Street is also going to succeed. We're not going to be able to defeat the banks directly, but maybe we can change enough hearts. And maybe the henchmen will turn on the greedy guys themselves. Thanks! This is my first vlog. Leave a comment below if you liked it.